hip hop saved my life. Big up to my dad. I remember going to him and saying, hey, yo, Pops, I want to go to the studio. Can I have $20? It buys me an hour. And with his unconditional love, he said, yeah, for sure. Just make sure when you come home, you have a song. So throughout my life, I've been very grateful to have people in my life to say, you need to produce an outcome. But check this out. Before I expect you to produce this outcome, you need access. I don't expect you to fight this monster with a Q-tip. If I'm going to give you a winning chance, let's get those power tools to the students of today so they can truly be those leaders of tomorrow. On my first day of teaching, I was given a chalk, one piece of chalk to teach. <laughs> I felt powerful. This tool would change the way I would teach. And I taught for 10 years at Hollenbeck Middle School. And it was up to me to make sure that the curiosity of all my students was cultivated and fostered. I did it with art. I did it with music, and I shared my story. I taught history in those 10 years. And I had to find a way to connect with my students, a way for them to be engaged, and a way for them to start changing their mindset. Because if we were going to transform Boyle Heights, which I always say is super innovative, the creativity is there. The leaders are evident. What was going to connect the dots? Art. Art would help me connect the dots. I would create over 100 podcasts in this after school program. I would take over 35 field trips in one year. I wanted to be the teacher I never had. And this magic that we were creating after school would invite other grade levels. Because friends would tell friends, and they say, hey, this place is unconditional. It's a place where you can create, a place where you can express yourself at the highest level. And it was important that the students develop those voices so they can be in the driver's seat and share their story. You are the sweetest. You are the sweetest. Sweetest girl I know around. I know that you're down. You make me feel like I've been, I've been all around. I just want to make you mine. I just want to make you mine. Say it again. Say it again. I know we can be more than friends. I love singing that song because a student wrote that. The power of student and teacher collaboration allows the art to blossom, to flourish. Technology is accelerating. And it's amazing that Boyle Heights can be part of this new shift in education. We have started a robotics team that's now competing with countries like Israel, Germany. It's a small rookie team, but they're planting the seeds of change. And it's been an amazing adventure. My students, you make me so proud. I will continue to be there for you. And we'll make sure that you have a fighting chance to change your situation. I'm Enrique. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs>